What's up everybody for the win Itachi here was goody just woke up this morning and I just realized there's some brand new Pokemon for Sun and Moon that have just been announced and I just thought we gotta make that video, you know what I mean? So let's go ahead and get into it. I'm gonna go ahead and check out this video for the very first time with you guys. Exciting new additions to Pokemon Sun and Moon. Again, they are brand new Pokemon. Sunfist? Oh no, Wimpod. It looks like a Sunfist type Pokemon. It is a bug and water type. Wimp out is its ability. It looks pretty damn decent, but it looks like a Sunfist. It's just basically a little bit of a Sunfist. Oh god damn. You're getting McRape. Wimp out. The wild Wimpod. Oh wow, that's an interesting ability right there. Uh, we got Bound Sweet. It's a grass type. Ability is Leaf Garden Oblivious. Basically like a little fruit peachy fruit thing. I don't know what it is, but it's a bug type. Oh! Oh, fairy type for sure! Comfy! That's gotta be the new- Oh, yeah, it is the new fairy type. Got that flower reveal and that tri-age ability. That's really cool. I'm surprised- Oh, that is so- That is perfect for the region. Wow, that looks absolutely amazing. Of course, it's going against a dragon type. Oh, a new horse! Mudsdale! It's a ground- Oh, it should be ground and fire type. Uh, own tempo and stamina. That is really cool. It does look very droopy and drowsy though, which I do not like. Uh, but it is a very cool and interesting looking Pokemon. It is a Mudsdale, of course. Ground type, that is a horse. That is next level coolness right there. Oh, the Pokemon we've all been waiting for, our BBQ. It is basically a ghost fairy type and it's got the ability of disguise. It basically is a Pokemon that looks like a Pikachu. It's a ghost of a Pikachu. It can mimic ghosts. I mean, it's a ghost that can mimic the looks of other Pokemon, kind of like a Ditto, uh, but it can only mimic Pikachus that I am aware of, and it looks very cool, and it's an interesting Pokemon that we will all be able to get in the Alola region. Beware, normal and fighting type, fluffy and klutz of the abilities, and it is a pink bear with rabbit ears. I, I, I don't know. Host your own competitions using the Pokemon Global Link. Ooh, that is very interesting. Yeah, oh, host our own tournaments. Hyper training, strengthen your Pokemon. Oh, we can change IVs now. Oh, dude. Oh my gosh, we can change our own IVs on our Pokemon. That is that that is just like a two second clip of that. I don't know why they didn't. I know why they didn't go into deep detail on that, but they gave us a little two second glimpse onto that, and that is very interesting to see. We get to change our own IVs on our Pokemon. Now let's go ahead and check them out, the actual Pokemon themselves, and let's get into deep details. Starting off with Wimpod, have a cowardly nature and they're very wary in their poises and sudden movements. If you approach them in a group, they'll immediately run off. When Wimpod feel threatened, they spit out a poisonous liquid. Uh, the stench of this toxic fluid signals others that, uh, that danger is near. And despite their extreme cowardice, their curiosity leads Wimpod to approach people of, or Pokemon that are standing still. Wimpod eat and sort everything that they find fallen on the ground. They also scavenge any garbage that's been dropped in the sea. So they're highly valued as cleaners. They sometimes carry pearls or other valuable items. So human or Pokemon like Murkrow may target them. Wimpod has the new Wimp Out ability, an ability that no other Pokemon has had before. With the Wimp Out ability, if this Pokemon's HP dropped below half in battle, it runs away or swaps out for another Pokemon. Interesting. Interesting. It's basically like a free charge. It, it's, uh, it's, it's, a, it's a weird and interesting ability. It's probably easy Pokemon to capture, so you don't want to lower it before half uh, below half health. And I'm assuming Murkrow are in the uh, Lola region. So, congratulations Murkrow to making it over to the seas. Category, it's a turn tail Pokemon, its type is bug and water. Height is just over 1, 26 pounds, and wimp out. God damn, these things are fat. They're fat for how small they are. Alright, we've got Mimikyu. Lives, in, lives its life completely covered by its cloth, and it's always hidden. People believe that anybody who sees its true form beneath the cloth will be stricken with a mysterious illness. People in the Alola region are convinced that you must never try to speak I mean, never try to peek beneath its covering Mimikyu's health fails uh, when it's ba bathed in the rays of the sun, so it prefers to stick to dark places. It's rumored that the reason it covers itself with a cloth is to avoid sunlight. That is not 100% the case. 
the rising popularity of Pikachu styled merchandise around 20 years ago is the reason that Mimikyu makes itself look like a Pikachu. Now that is more like the case. In fact, this Pokemon is dreadfully lonely and it thought it would be able to make friends in humans if only it looked like a Pikachu. Mimikyu, the disguise ability, a new ability that no other po no other Pokemon has ever possessed, the disguise ability allows it to escape damage from an enemy's attack just one time, and then its appearance changes. So categories, the disguised Pokemon, its type is Ghost and Fairy, height, 8, weight, just over 1, and ability is disguise. And this is a very interesting type, dual type of Ghost and Fairy, so that is very, very cool Pokemon. Definitely my favorite of this whole thing, but my second favorite right behind that is this Mudsdale here. Known for its powerful body, as well as emotional fortitude, which keeps it from being agitated by anything. It never cries out, no matter what kind of trouble it's in, and it defeats its opponent with a single powerful blow. Its legs are coated in protective mud, and the way- oh, so that is mud. It looked like fiery red fur to me. And the weight of it, this coating increases the force of its kick. One kick and a car is a pile of scrap. Mudsdale running speed is not too swift, but it has excellent power and stamina. It can carry on for three days and three nights despite dragging loads of over 10 tons. Wow. When Mudsdale gallops in earnest, wow, I couldn't even see that. The power of each hoof clop can dig our hu out huge holes. Even in asphalt, Mudsdale is forbidden to run on some of Alola's public roads. Mudsdale can have new stamina ability, an ability that no other Pokemon has had before with a stamina ability. The Pokemon's defense goes up by one when it's hit by an attack. Wow! OP to the Oshis! Draft Horse Pokemon, ground, height is over 8, weight is over 2,000, and then its ability is own tempo and that really cool new ability of stamina. Next up, we got that fairy. Comfy picks flowers and, and always carries them around. It makes a ring of blossoms and spreads oil from its body on it, which changes the flowers so they emit a soothing fragrance. Okay. It has a habit of giving these flower rings to those it's fond of. The aroma can soothe, bathe itself, and its alley's comfy uh, also helps with the treatment of people and po pe and Pokemon at Pokemon centers and hospitals thanks to the aroma. So as you can see, there's a strand of flowers attached to each other and there's a little tiny green Pokemon. That is Comfy itself. So that is a real small Pokemon as we can see with the height being uh, 0.4 and the weight being 0.7 and the ability of Flower Veal and Triage Category is a posy picker Pokemon and its type is fairy. When attacked by other Pokemon, it throws its flowers at them to create an opening and then it either flees or strikes back. Comfy can have the new triage ability, an ability that no other Pokemon has ever had before. With the triage ability, the Pokemon restorative moves gain the highest priority in battle. So it can heal much faster than anyone else dealing damage. That is really interesting and I cannot wait to try that one out. When Beware is acting in a friendly fashion, just swinging its arms around, you must never dare to approach it carelessly. It is acknowledged to be a dangerous Pokemon. Even within the Alola region, you may see warning signs posted near places it resides. So it looks like the cutest Pokemon ever, but it's going to give you the fuck you, bitch. And yeah, it's going to kill you. When Beware grows fond of its trainer, it may show that in a fond embrace, but the force of of that hug is tremendous. Trainers must teach these Pokemon how to restrain their strength when showing affection. Beware may have Fluffy Ability, a new ability that no other Pokemon has ever had before. The Fluffy Ability halves the damage taken from attacks that make direct contact, but in return it also doubles the damage taken from fire type moves. Interesting. So this category is a strong arm Pokemon. Again, it's got super duper strength. Type is normal in fighting, its height is over 6, its weight is 297, and its ability is Fluffy and Klutz. Fluffy is a really cool and interesting ability as well. Last but not least, we did see, because it excludes a delicious smell from its entire body, Bound Sweets is popular with Pokemon and people in the Alola region. Bound Sweets sent 
it has a common effect on humans, so many people let them live inside their homes as a sort of air freshener. Unfortunately, it's sometimes swallowed whole by Pokemon drawn to its aroma. So it is type of a fr it's a fruit. It's a fruity. It's a fruit bug. Oh, it's a grass type. So it's a fruit grass type. All right, cool. When running away from other Pokemon bounce, sweet flees danger by skipping along the ground. Since its bouncy movements don't convey to others that it's actually in desperate flight, no one ever comes to its aid. When attacked by enemies, it drives them off by rotating the calyx on its head. The downside is the dizziness it gets afterwards. It's a fruit Pokemon. Okay, makes sense. So I was right. I didn't even see that beforehand. Type is grass. Height is 1. Weight is 7.1. And its ability is Leaf Guard and Oblivious. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. These are some very interesting Pokemon. We just witnessed six brand new Pokemon. What was your favorite? Post in the comment section down below. Check out that description box. Thank you very much for tuning in. Further, when it talks, she is out.